It's a Deep Slant 101 presented by Xfinity. Our guest this week, left tackle Laramie Tunsil. Laramie, welcome to the studio. Glad to be here. Have you ever been sure. on this side of the hallway nah, before? Never, never. You've not? Never. All not. right, starting left tackle, mm -hmm. you're amazing. We all know that. But I feel like people really want to know who the real Laramie is. Let's do it. So the first day that you actually spoke to the media, you're wearing your Guns N' Roses 1992 tour shirt. Of course. And I don't know if you know this, but the media like fell in love with you. Really? After they the did. Guns N' Roses on. It, well, not so much that. I mean, I think everything, like just how you were with them and, you know, you like music. You've talked about your taste in music. Mm -hmm. Pink Floyd is one of your favorites. Yes, yes, ma'am. Pink Floyd. Is that your sure. favorite? Probably my, More than Guns N' Roses? Yeah, it's Pink Floyd, then probably System of a Down. Oh, so okay. Yeah, System of a Down with a heavy metal. Can I ask you, you've got this like Mount Rushmore of music artists on your back. Yes. Who, I, I mean, I don't want to stare, but like, who are they? Because I... Jimi Hendrix. Okay. Tupac, Bob Marley, and Prince. Okay, so those are your like top, yeah, top four. Top top four and then top genres I like. Hip hop, rock, R and B. Okay. Your musical taste is pretty varied and you like some old school stuff. Like Love you, old school. Love you like blues. you do? You're yeah. like an old soul. Mm -hmm. How did you get into that kind of music? I don't know, it kinda of just like came to me when I was in college. It's funny to say because I really wasn't like this in high school. What did you like in high school? Like straight hip hop. Okay. Okay. <laughs> straight hip hop and now <laughs> when I got to college. I don't know, I just started loving Old school, I don't know, it's, it's weird. Yeah, I think it fits your personality. Yeah. I did some digging on you, so don't oh, be freaked oh, out by oh my gosh. stalking skills. I found out your uh, go-to karaoke song is Sade, No Ordinary Love. Oh, that hell true? yeah, that's my, yeah. That is my favorite <laughs> yeah, Sade sure. song. I love Sade. But I, I can't really picture you singing it because Sade is kind of- We gotta have a karaoke night. We, I feel like, like, like do we that. are doing a disservice <laughs> if you don't sing it. So you're into Sade too. Mm -hmm. I like Sade. Yeah. Like Sade the Sade. Greatest Hits is actually one of my most favorite albums yes, of, of all time. Um, okay, so in sports, if you had to do a Mount Rushmore of athletes on your back. Is this basketball or just like This can football? be whatever you want. Oh, I won't even tough. like limit it to NFL football. That's tough. I don't watch sports like that, but um. Do you watch any other sports like in your free time? Basketball, but not like that. Like you're not a diehard fan? I'm not a diehard sports fan at all. Did you play a lot of sports growing up I played basketball and football. That was amazing. In high school, yes. Did you do track as well? I did shot put my sophomore year, but that didn't work out well. It didn't. No. Nah. Why is that? I was throwing like a 36, and I think people above me was on like 50. <laughs> <laughs> so why why did the basketball thing not work out? How'd you how did you go football over basketball? Uh, if I would have made it to the NBA, I'd be playing point guard. So that's one thing I stopped. So you didn't I want to be point guard. No, I wouldn't be a point guard at all. What did you want to be? Center, for sure. Power forward. You center. wanted to be a center Power over a forward center, yeah. Oh, all day, okay. All day, but 6'5", for sure get to the NBA playing point guard. How tall were you in high school when you were playing basketball? 6'4". Six, 6'3", four. Six, six, four. So you grew like one more inch yeah. when you got into college? <laughs> yep. Alright, so you go to Ole Miss. I feel like I would picture you more of a California guy, but how did you end up at I like, Ole Miss? I like Cali, but um, I actually had a, a official visit to Ole Miss, and Robert Kimdichi and Laquan Trevor was there. And we came, we got there, we, we sat down in this little room, we was all talking. We was like, why don't we go to Alabama or Georgia? We could just come to Ole Miss and we change the program around. Okay. And that's one thing we did, be Alabama. We won a team. We, mm -hmm. Unfortunately, we didn't win a championship, but we won both games. So the goal was to beat a really good team like yeah, Alabama? Of course. Just to bring that program to the top, and I think that's what we did. Did you ever look at Texas? Never looked Any at Texas. Any Texas schools? No. no? That was, was it ever in your thinking that you might end up one day living in Texas? Never thought that. Really? Never thought that. Did you think you'd live in California or Texas? I wanted to live in California when I'm done with everything, for sure. Yeah. State tax is kind of crazy, but. Well, Texas, no state tax. Yeah, so, exactly. I mean, you've Florida, got that. No state and tax. you can visit California for yeah, way exactly. cheaper. Mm -hmm. I mentioned California because your fashion, you're, you're probably one of the swaggiest old linemen. Thank you. I think. And I think it's hard to do Thank as you. an old lineman because you're a little bit bigger. Mm -hmm. um, can I say that? Is that yeah, fair of to course. Say? It's true. Right. So, how, how did you get your sense of style or fashion? That came in college, too, matter of fact. At Ole Miss? That's, yeah, <laughs> no offense to Ole Miss. People <laughs> no, watching, but yeah. no, that came in college. Um, my brother actually the one who started putting on some swag, and then I just took it over from there. Okay. Yeah. What did your did your brother play wide receiver? Wide receiver. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So he does he dress like anybody on the Texans that you could compare him to? Oh, uh, he does. He has his own style too. Own style. Yeah, we got okay. our own style. Okay. Like copy of yeah. So how would you describe your style compared to most? My mine's kind of like <laughs> hippie-ish, rock and rollish, modern days, like old school. Like I'm I'm all over the place. 
Yeah. When it comes to fashion. You got your rock t-shirts, mm -hmm. and then you had these Gucci pants. Which, which, which was fake. Which were fake. You yeah. made sure, you uh -huh. shouldn't tell which people that, because yeah, nobody would not? know. You're an NFL player. You can pose it. No, I don't want to. You want people to know they're, they're, they're fake. fake. Yeah. Have you been to Harwin and Hillcroft in the Houston area? Because I think Never. you would really enjoy the shops. Is that like a mall? Yeah, you could probably have your choice of fake Gucci's. And I don't That's know if I should be advertising. <laughs> fake Prada, Pradas. <laughs> yeah. You get your choice of fake Pradas and whatnot there. That'd be good. I also read that you're really into aliens. Huh. What's okay, the... we digging deep. Oh here. yeah, I, yeah. I could be a PI detective. Okay. What's your uh, favorite alien movie of all time? I don't have, I've never seen the alien, E.T., what? E.T. is an alien movie. Yeah, Men in Black, only, Predator, like, alien. That was alien. not alien movies, like. It's one movie I've actually seen, but I just don't know the name of it. Okay, oh what God, is it? I don't know. Is it old, is it? It's an old movie, for sure. Old movie. Okay. So but I don't watch alien? alien movies like that. I don't watch, I'm not a movies guy. I used to get so much stuff about that, like, people used to come pick on me and everything. Because, because you're I, not in I, the movies? I don't watch movies at all. Like, Lion King, I seen it one time, and, I don't remember anything. That's when I was young. Okay. You why you don't like going to movie? You just don't like going to the movie theaters. You don't like the experience. Just not of a it? movie guy. Just never been. Okay. Just never been a movie guy. You do like shows though. TV I love shows? concerts. Concerts. Okay. Concerts. What's TV a, shows. Uh. You because you, okay. We'll get to the shows okay. in a second. Last concert you went to. Last concert I went to was the Dreamville Fest in North Carolina. Oh okay. Yeah. Dreamville. Mm -hmm. J Cole. Uh, yeah, those shirts are everywhere. The Dreamville yeah. shirts. So dope. I got a couple shirts too. You got a couple. Okay, so J Cole is uh, anybody that you want to see that's on tour will be on tour. Uh, Summer Walker. <laughs> I don't know if y'all know Summer Walker. I do. I know Summer Walker. Oh, you do. Know, yeah, she's coming here. Nice what about Lizzo? Lizzo, Lizzo, was Lizzo here. she was just here, yeah. Houston, yeah. yeah. I, I like that much. you're into the female and yeah, of course, the, I of like course, that. You're yeah. very diverse yeah. in your mm -hmm. rock and your hip hop. But I'm looking forward to some walk. I can't wait to see Okay. Her. I think okay. she comes out the 30th, I'm not sure. Okay, so you're big into concerts. Not yeah. in the movies, big into concerts. Mm -hmm. You are into Stranger Things, though. Oh, shit. That's my show. Like I see. That. I knew. I, I but it's knew based. Like it's based on the back it's of the aliens. day. It's aliens. Aliens. You know what I'm saying? Yes. Very weird. That's right in my alley. And the music is really good. It's yeah, good yeah. 80s music. Did you see their style? It's kind of like the the 70s. It's 80s. like 80s. Yeah, I for mean, sure. I, I don't know if 80s are in yet. What well, are, are they in again? Is it old enough I, that it's, it's in, in again? for me? You, so well, you're, you yeah. can probably carry that off. Mm -hmm. So you like? Is there any other show that you, you binge watch? Uh, Stranger Stranger Things, Snowfall. And oh, it's a new series that just came out called Wu Tang Clan. <laughs> so is I don't it, know. It, is it about Wu Tang? It's Clan? about Wu Tang. Yeah. Oh, cool. I mean, them. that yeah. does not surprise me. Yeah, you should. It's, it's a good show too. Sure. Wu Tang Clan. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, travel. Do you like to travel? I do. I don't mind traveling. Okay. Where's the best place that you've ever gone on vacation? Uh, Costa Rica for sure. Oh, okay, yeah. First time going zip lining is pretty dope. Yes, that's actually I've gone zip lining into the jungle, so the dope. rainforest. So I'm a, I'm a bigger guy. So <laughs> it's like extra reinforced. I was flying down the home. It was so much fun. <laughs> well, that's a little scary though, because if you are, a I'm little kind of like a daredevil though. Okay, so you like, like my biggest thing? I want to skydive. I gotta go skydive okay. soon. Like probably this off season. I gotta go skydive. Like jumping out of a uh, skydiving is jumping out of. The, I, I always it's, confuse it with uh, a parasailing. Skydiving is when you jump out of the. You've when done you jump that. out of the plane. Okay. Yeah. So uh, I, I probably uh, that's not really something <laughs> I would do. Where, where would you like to travel that you haven't been yet? Uh, I want to go to Greece. I want to go to uh, Amsterdam for sure. Okay. Uh, th Thailand. <laughs> uh -huh. uh, that's probably it so far. I, don't know, I, I I like to pick places based on the food that I like. So okay. I would I would definitely do Greece Greece because I love Greek food. You, you seem to be a foodie yourself, right? Of course, yeah. big guy. How do you? So uh, yes, I found out about Greece through Kenny Stills. Kenny Stills went to Greece. He went to Greece. Yes, he said okay. the food is amazing. So I'm gonna check it out. Well, Houston is great for trying out all these different foods. By it the way, is. how it have is. you been able to? Have have you liked Houston so far? Yes, I haven't been nowhere. I was like, have you gotten out of the <laughs> stadium in I your have, house? No, I haven't been no. nowhere okay. besides the O-line dinner, but. How have those been? Can, can I ask, like, do you remember any of, like, a place that stands out The to last you? place I went to was, we got a dinner tonight, but the last place I went to, Steak 48. Oh, yes, of course. So it's pretty good. Yes, it's pretty good. We're, they're known for steaks here. Yeah. Uh, so who eats the most out of the O-line group? Mm -hmm. I want to see if it's changed since you joined. I'm going to have to give it to the Rook. I'm going to give it to Titus. I was like, which one? Oh, Titus out <laughs> Titus, everyone. Titus, yeah, for sure. Okay. Uh, music, just to circle back, mm -hmm. you played a lot of instruments. Mm -hmm. I, I thought of this because Titus can sing, from what I've heard. Yeah, he told me today he was in a choir. He was in a choir. And yeah. you play a lot of instruments. Mm -hmm. 
play Can the guitar. Can you list all the instruments you play? Because I think I'm going to forget one. I know the basics of the guitar, the bass, and the piano. Okay. The keys. Okay. I know the basics. Did you teach yourself? I taught myself, yeah. I actually had a guy in Miami. That's really impressive. Yeah, I actually had a guy in Miami who taught me how to play the guitar. Okay. Yeah, so he used to give me lessons. Is it, it's not similar, though, like guitar to piano to bass? It's kind of got the same notes, but it's not similar, if that makes sense. I okay. don't know if that makes sense. You have a beat, you got a beat pad, too, I right? I do have a beat pad. Do you make beats? I do make Are beats. Are you going to produce music one day? Do you think that's, that's my goal. I that's, think that's a very cool goal. That'd be dope, huh? Yeah, to make that's, some beats. That's my goal. But the main thing with music, you gotta be consistent. You gotta be consistent with it. So, have you been practicing? Uh, since I've been down here, no. <laughs> I mean, you got all this free time, Laramie, right? Yeah, I like, know, right? You just and go home, go you just home like, play and, the piano. And lay down, yeah. But yeah. Miami, I used to used to be on the music a lot. I don't have none of my equipment down here, but okay. I get it down here. I think that maybe in the off season, you and Titus, Zach Cunningham's a great singer too, yeah. by the way. Mm -hmm, yes. Yeah, you guys should make some beats That'd together. Be That's just my suggestion. All right, what other uh, impressions of Houston before I let you go? Uh, you were complaining about traffic the other day. Traffic is horrible, bro. Yeah, you're you're a true Houstonian if you're complaining about traffic. Traffic like the rest is of horrible, us. I didn't know Worse that than bad. Miami? Yes. Really? Okay. Yes. I thought Miami was pretty bad. Miami is, is pretty bad, but I, we can get through. You can take back roads. And Houston seems like you can't take no back roads. Yeah, you got to give it a minute. I think you'll yeah. find some. Houston cool, though. It's I cool. Like All right. Well, welcome to Houston, Laramie. It's good to get to know you. For sure. All right. Thanks so much. Mm, cool.